Only KITV4 was there as a frog smuggling raid was going down. KITV4's Catherine Cruz has the exclusive video. Families living along Pinal Street didn't quite know what to think when their neighborhood was suddenly crawling with law enforcement. Residents and officers all wanted to know what might be crawling around inside this house. Neighbors didn't know much about the man who lives here, but believed he made a living selling animals online. Investigators wouldn't say what they were looking for, what they had seized, but they did carry out about a dozen sealed aquariums. But chirping cricket noises coming from the house was a clue. Late in the afternoon, investigators confirmed it. Those crickets are food, and poison dart frogs are the merchandise. Agricultural officials say four frogs were found in a shipment sent through the post office. About 20 more were in the home. Law enforcement officers arrested the 50-year-old resident on charges of trying to smuggle in poison dart frogs through the mail. He was brought in for questioning and booked on misdemeanor smuggling charges. He was later released pending the investigation. A check of online sites referred to the suspect as a collector and seller of rare fish and frogs. All live animals imported into the state require a permit from the Department of Agriculture. Poison dart frogs are native to Central and South America. And officials say while there are some colonies of dart frogs found on Oahu and Maui, it is illegal to transport them within or out of the islands. During the transport, one of the aquariums broke and a couple of frogs tried to make a break for it. Fortunately, they were quickly contained. In Manoa, Catherine Cruz, KITV4 News. The state has an amnesty program that allows people to turn in illegal animals without being prosecuted. Now, if you know of anyone who has an illegal animal in their custody, you can call the state's pest hotline. That number is 646-PEST.